written apology and order of resignation of higher authorities, the ex-principal, the MSBP, who was previously the Dean of Student Affairs, the HOD of Chess Medicine, they should be barred from holding any administrative or authoritative position in any institution for the remaining duration of their service period. CBI should also immediately probe into culprits responsible for mob attack on Arjikar MCH on 14-8-2024, attempt to destroy the crime scene and tamper with evidence. Stringent workplace security measures must be implemented in all medical colleges and other healthcare facilities. Public apology of the Commissioner of Police regarding the brutal assault upon medical students and junior doctors on 10-8-2024. Before we state our demands and plan of action, we would like to emphasize on the fact that it has been seven days since 9th August, the day on which a heinous crime was committed with a, within our college, inside this very college campus, a heinous crime was committed with our colleague inside this very college, college campus. Due to non-transparency, the investigation process has been shifted from Kolkata police to the CBI. But even after 48 hours, the demands of justice that we had are not fulfilled at all. We have no clarity regarding the ongoing investigation process. Along with this, on the day of independence, when people of West Bengal on, were on the streets standing in solidarity with our movement, right on that very night, a heinous attack was committed in Arjikar in a planned way, which dismantled the emergency room along with several government properties. Rape threats were also made to Arjikar nurses. This attack was an attempt to terrorize the non-violent protesters as well as a malicious attempt to shift the focus from the movement for social justice by the society. Still, we remain undeterred from our road to justice. In light of recent information about the closure of OPD and emergency services, we want to clarify that both services are operating efficiently. Our dedicated professors are fully committed in providing medical care, ensuring that the community continues to receive necessary medical services. There is no reason to believe that access to medical care has been compromised. No compensation can ever replace a lost life. And we stand with the decision of the parent of the disease in this regard. Finally, we request the citizens of India to refrain from sharing any false information regarding the ongoing incidents and fully support us in our fight for justice. In these desperate times, we have united to form the West Bengal Junior Doctors Front who will continue to fight till justice is served. Arrest of all the culprits immediately with proper evidence with official press release confirming the same by the CBI, written apology and order of resignation of higher authorities, the ex-principal, the MSBP who was previously the Dean of Student Affairs, the HOD of Chess Medicine, the Assistant Superintendent on duty on 9-8-2024 at RGCOR MCH, and they should be barred from holding any administrative or authoritative position in any institution for the remaining duration of their service period. These above-mentioned demands have to be officially issued by Shastu Bhavan immediately. Also, we do not comply with the order from Shastu Bhavan, memo number HFO, MAMES, H07, ME, TP, 29-2024, dated 12-8-2024, and ME, MISC, 13417, part 1, M, 2021, dated 11-8-2024 regarding reinstatement of ex-principal of RGCOR MCH as the principal of CNMC and appointment of ex-dean of student affairs of RGCOR MCH as MSVP of RGCOR MCH respectively. We still demand clarification and proper documents, official order copy and letters with proper memo number and date regarding the controversial renovation work of chest medicine department that was reported by various reputed media houses. We also demand that the concerned authority, the present and ex-principal, the MSVP, the HOD of chest medicine, the store manager, PWD, special investigation team, SIT members, and DC North should be interrogated by the CBI in suspicion of evidence tampering and they be prosecuted if found guilty.
CBI should also immediately probe into culprits responsible for mob attack on Arjikar MCH on 14 8 2024 attempt to destroy the crime scene and tamper with evidence, vandalization of government property, rape threats out to staff nurses on duty, identification and interrogation of people using this mob attack as an opportunity to terrorize protesters and take necessary actions regarding them. Accountability and liability of the college authorities and commissioner of police in this incident. Stringent workplace security measures must be implemented in all medical colleges and other healthcare facilities with special emphasis on subcenters, PHC, DPHC and strict hospitals, including the installation of CCTV cameras, the presence of both male and female security guards, continuous police picketing and patrolling, and the provision of proper on-call rooms with washroom facilities. These measures should be enacted immediately to ensure the safety and well-being of all staff. Public apology of the Commissioner of Police regarding the brutal assault upon medical students and junior doctors on 10-8-2024 and lack of action and utter incompetence on the Day of Independence by the Kolkata Police. They should also provide written assurance that such incidents will not be repeated in the future. Immediate strict and necessary action against digital defamation of the deceased and other students of Arjikar MCH that is still being circulated on social media. Our next plan of action being, emergency services have not been disrupted. However, as our safety at workplace has not yet been ensured, we are unable to resume our services despite our best intentions. As for the appeal of the High Court, we have formed a legal body to place our opinion in the upcoming court proceedings. We also want to state the fact that some institutions are forcing the participants to work, especially the MOTRs. We have also seen that whenever doctors have come to protest for their fallen ones, there comes pressures from some quarters to withdraw from their rightful demands of justice. We vehemently condemn all such attempts to un uh, undermine doctors' unity, we remain united and committed in our pursuit of justice. We stand in solidarity with the nurses, nursing staff and nursing students of Arjikar MCH in the stand for women workplace safety and we strongly condemn the shameful tactics of the DNS, NS and other higher officials attempting to hamper their support. We sincerely request the consensus general public to walk with us in a mass protest rally on Sunday 18 8, 2024 at 1 p.m. from College Square to Shambhajar to raise the collective voices against injustice and compel the authorities to take action in favor of public good. We are deeply grateful for the support we have received from the students, the medical and paramedical communities and the general public for their unwavering solidarity that has revitalized our spirit of justice.